Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 This is Games and Graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we are going to be making a updated video to installing game config. All right. This one is the latest game config updated as of uh from today is august 28th 2021 so this will be the latest updated one right here and what we want to do is go ahead and uh scroll down first of all read the full description before you would download any script or mod after you do that you want to come up here where it says current and select the green arrow to download all right this one right here is created by f7yo all right shout out to the creator now if you had looked inside of the description there is two um, important requirements we are going to need which the first one is heap adjuster when you click on this link right here is going to lead you to this page right here which is the heap adjuster download page this one right here is created by um die dia <laughs> dilapi dated or something but this is the creator right here shout out to the creator all right we'll just call him deal for right now <laughs> um and the next link which will uh, the, be the next requirement we are going to need is pack file limit adjuster that link is going to lead you to this page right here this one is created by unknown modder shout out to the creator and uh, what you want to do is read the description come right here where it says current select the green arrow to download all right now let's go back to the game config download page and there's another important download that we are going to need or requirement that is going to be open for if you don't have open for installed already just check the links in the description there will be a video explaining how to install open for if you don't have it already so make sure that you have your open for installed once you have your open for installed and you have your game config heap adjuster and your pack file limit adjuster downloaded should look something like this on my left hand side i have three downloads i have uh the game config heap adjuster pack file limit adjuster on my right hand side i have my grand theft auto 5 directory opened up now let's go ahead and start off with the pack file limit adjuster open up that folder inside that folder is going to be two files in a readme we are going to take those two files that i have highlighted and drag and drop both of those files right here into our grand theft auto 5 directory i already have them as you can see now let's go back to our downloads by pressing the back arrow now let's go into our heap adjuster any folder all right open up the heap adjuster folder inside that folder we are going to have two files now before we drag and drop those files, let's go ahead and open up the heap adjuster any, which is the configuration settings file. Okay, it's going to have a gear on it. Go ahead and double click on that to open it up. Once it opens up, you're going to see it's going to say heap settings and then have heap size. And it's going to be set to 750. Let's go ahead and change that 750 to 10,000. All right. Now we're just uh, upping the heap size to try to um, extend out the game's memory. All right. Now, once that is set to 10,000, you go ahead, select file, select save, and then exit out. All right. So now that this is saved right here, let's go ahead and highlight both of those. Drag and drop both files inside the heap adjuster folder over here into our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. All right. Once that's dragged and dropped, let's go back to our downloads. And now we want to install our game config. But before we do that, we need to open up Open 4. So open up your Open 4. I have my Open 4 open up on my right hand side. Before we go any further, make sure you have your edit mode turned on. After that is turned on, let's go into your GTA 5 config folder. Inside that folder is going to be three folders and two text documents. We want to go into the GTA config folder right here. Okay. Open that one up and there is going to be a lot of folders. All right. There's going to be, um, let's start off at the least to the most. The first one is going to be zero one times traffic. And the most is going to be five times traffic, five times pit. Okay. 
Now this is an important part when installing a game config and you want to have a lot of cars installed or a lot of add-on pads installed, then you want to try to get the least um, the least traffic in pads, okay? So as I have been installing game configs and making these tutorials, I always choose this one right here that I have selected, which is the 01 traffic and 01 pads, all right? Now, if you wanted more traffic, then you could go ahead and um, go to higher folders where you have uh, more traffic and more pads, okay? So um, it pretty much is the least at the top and it's the most at the bottom, all right? So this is the one I usually go for because I install a lot of PIDs and a lot of uh, a lot of uh, mods and scripts and things like that. So I always go for the zero one traffic and zero one PIDs. All right. So for today's tutorial, we are going to install that one. Let's open up that folder, and inside there's going to be our game config. Okay. Now let's go to our open four. What we want to do is navigate to uh, update in the side column. Select update then select the update.rpf. Once you select that, a red banner should pop up. It's going to say copy the mods folder. It, go ahead and select copy the mods folder. If you have it in your mods folder already, then select show in mods folder. Once that has been copied to your mods folder, go ahead and select common folder, then select a data folder. Then this area is where we are going to be dragging and dropping our game config. If you look right here, you should see a game config.xml already here. So let's go to our downloads where we had our folder with our game config chose. And I have chosen my 01 traffic, 01 pads. We're going to select that game config, drag and drop it over here to open four. All right. Drag and drop, and that is it. So from this point, you are. Um, able to go ahead and install um, a large amount of mods and scripts but still pay attention to uh, what those mods or scripts might conflict with because other scripts conflict with other scripts sometimes as well as mods so always pay attention to what you are installing okay so um, as of this point there's no need to run the game because it will work but I'll run it anyway so uh, let's go ahead and run the game so as you can see, we have spawned in the game and uh, yeah, <laughs> game works. Uh, this is another thing uh, that you could install that will help game crashes or um, startup crashes. You know, when you turn on the game and it crash on startup, this will definitely be a good solution for that. All right. Or if you're running with a lot of cars or a lot of things installed and um, you have game crashes while you're playing your game, this will definitely help that out. All right. So uh, we are going to go ahead and end the tutorial right here. But if this helps y'all out to install the game you just it correctly or if you just enjoyed the sure? video, feel free to smash that like button for me and uh, definitely subscribe to the channel <laughs> if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are in the modding GTA 5, y'all. This is the game to graphics, me and uh, Big Ball and as Frank. We are out of here until next time, y'all. Man, you suck. Hey, fuck you, bitch. Would you fuck off? You gonna die, bitch! You a bad motherfucker, we huh? Bust that job. Oh shit! <laughs>